So I haven't been able to really enjoy playing video games just on my own for quite a long time because I've been stressed out about like, oh, I have to make content out of this thing for my channel. And in the last like few weeks, I've actually been playing just games on my own without streaming them quite a bit and enjoying myself. So yeah, like maybe, maybe. Gaming has always been a passion of mine and when you connect a passion of yours to work and the need to pay rent and buy your food and survive, like the dynamic changes a lot, right? That might be deliberate, Taurus That might be deliberate. You love paying rent, nothing like paying for someone else's investment while depriving yourself of a future. Yeah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> exactly. Would it be detrimental to just turn on the stream while you play without worrying about entertainment? I mean, I just wouldn't necessarily like it. Like, presumably you could stream yourself, you know, doing whatever you do all day, every day, but you choose not to. <laughs> I don't imagine it's hard for you to work out why you personally choose not to do that. Um, it probably works the same for me. All of the things that you assume could be awful about being on camera in front of hundreds or thousands of people constantly are real, pretty much. Like, yeah. Those aren't just like made up. How many the 19 months? What does the crown do? Look at this. What is this? Berserker stance. Skill bonus gain two vigor. It can trigger up to three times. Finisher bonus gain one strength. The crown enters either defensive or berserker stance at the start of fights. So if I play this, I get two bigger. Then I get another five from playing that. Okay, understood. Am I playing downfall now because I'm enjoying it? Because uh, I want to? Just because I want to. Challenge. I've not seen any of this character's cards, so here we go. Taunt applies a weak and a vulnerable. Parry. Gain 6 block. Gain 10 counter. If you counter, is used this turn. Gain repost. Repost. Ethereal. Deal damage equal to the amount of counter used. Exhaust. It bugs me that they reused art from Slay the Spire, because I, I think that the cards are going to be a certain thing, you know? Like, I think that's going to be Cleave. 8 block, 8 damage if the target has strength, repeat these effects at once. Wait, Philo Stone? That's an interesting card. How many enemies have strength on this game? Like all of the bosses. Okay, not... Oh, well the bosses are different. <laughs> right. Defect won't, I don't think. Defect also won't be affected much by weak. I just take big iron wave. Charges remaining three. So I do that, gaining me vigor, and then I do that. I'm in no stance right now, but I could enter defensive stance. What is this? What is? What are these animations? They're beautiful, is what they are. Skill bonus gain three counter. Can take her up to three times. So, finisher bonus is gain block. I think I just want to be in. Uh, that stance. Hmm. 
Why did I? Oh, because I played Iron Wave. <laughs> okay. Okay. Look at him cower. You love this stupid armor himbo. Yeah, well, there you go. Fan of knives. If I'm in Berserker, it's a dagger spray. I'll take a dagger spray. Uh, yeah, I don't know. Maybe you just always stay in Berserker? Seems a lot better than defensive stance. Seems way better than defensive stats. All right, anyway. Bob and Weave. Four block, four vigor. Enter Berserker. Another way into Berserker. Trigger skill bonus for each enemy hit. What? <laughs> that isn't keyworded. I don't... I... Oh, it... It gives me vigor for every enemy hit. Okay, I understand now. I remember. I got Bob and Weave. Second way into Wrath. Oh shit, the merchant fights me. <laughs> I probably knew that. Counter is just not an exciting mechanic. All right. Gain two random skills with retain. That seems decent. Not seem bad at all. Ultimate stance. Okay, so this is actually Watcher. <laughs> just, just actually Watcher. Enter ultimate stance for one turn. Let's go for it. So I'm in defensive stance, but I can enter berserker stance. And then this does the thing. Maybe I should have deplication potion to that. Goxio! Yeah, I'm doing well. Choose a stance to enter. If you are already in that stance, gain a combo of that stance. Bang! I didn't notice the character. Hmm. <laughs> Why do I have this? I don't even. Where did this even come from? Uh, 
I don't understand what's going on. I have a ceramic fish. Deal six damage without consuming vigor. Perfecter strike. Wait, what? Isn't it? But it's worse. Isn't it? Doesn't perfected strike have a higher base damage value? Probably not. Okay, whatever. I'm not taking that. I will take this, I think. Perfecter hits all enemies. Wait, it was AoE? Oh my gosh. This is not less balanced than Watcher. I'm just gonna like... I'm just gonna cut you off right there. No way this can possibly be less balanced than Watcher. If you're in defensive, you inc this is like Rampage for block? Oh shit. Maybe I should go for defensive. Does counter stay? It does. I don't understand what's happening. So if I play this, it doesn't consume vigor, it just deals 11. That seems fine. He can enter ultimate stance, which counts as both defensive and berserker stances. And if I leave it before it expires, I immediately re-enter it. How do I ever leave it then? <laughs> Am I just in it for the rest of the fight? Wait, I didn't go into it. Any stance. Oh, I have to be in a stance for it to do anything. Okay. This is this is a lot. You leave it when it expires, but it doesn't say that it expires. <laughs> like that's cool and what I would expect, but it doesn't say that it expires. Smiling Mask. Triple Strike. Deal 6 damage, gain 2 strikes, they cost 0 and trigger skill bonuses. We're doing the Strikes Matter thing again. I don't like that thing. Probably an okay card though. Alright. So I'm in Wrath form. They're all dead. Now we're going to defensive form. <laughs> Um, I just took worse riddle waffles. Did I? It deals more damage for two than riddle with holes does. I'm good. Maybe. It's really impossible to say.
Oh. <laughs> yeah, I meant to do that. <clears throat> Feels way more damage than where it all falls because the strikes proc your berserker thing. So much better than riddle with halls. A card from your discard pile on top of your draw pile. That's headbutt. I'm sure that that's good. I am not going to take it. It's too much thinking. Ultimate Drain. Ultimate stance will expire this turn. Oh, okay. That seems like a good thing to like tell the player. In some sort of like description of what it is. So that's a finisher, but it doesn't consume vigor. I'm just saying out loud what it is, I guess. card literally says one turn. Enter ultimate stance for one turn. Okay. So different cards enter ultimate stance for different amounts of time? Metallo footwork? Let's take this and make a lot of strength. Ceramic fish, a smiling mask, and omomori. Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> yeah, I know. Oh my god. Oh my god. <sighs> Gain six block increased by vigor. You can block a lot with this character. I did not realize. I did not realize how much block I was going to have access to.
You like how emotive the champ is? For sure. Me too. I'm gonna love the next two bosses. We'll see. I didn't like... Who even was it last time? Hexaghost? I guess Hexaghost... I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I think... Yeah. Yeah. I have opinions, I guess. During your next turn, you're in ultimate stance. Why does every character have access to intangible? This is just... they just made intangible better. But like, why? It isn't... it's not... You can't use finisher?! Oh my god. It retains because I uh, created it by that thing that creates skills and gives them retain. I assume. I assume that's why. Can't stack ignore pain? Are you sure? I feel like you probably can. In this case, it makes sense because the champ never loses. Apparently not. Whenever a defect generates a void, it goes to the top of your draw pile. That's kind of rude. It's like, it's the read. You had a good stream. Oh god, your muscles are so big. I'm actually in the top right of the screen. You're looking at the champ. Speaking of which, let's get off their energy. I'm not worried that the bot will humanize the bosses too much and you won't have the same ferocity fighting them in the future. Uh, the exact opposite, actually. I find it... so far... has made fighting the bosses quite a lot more interesting. Okay, I did that thing, I guess. I'm on 12. Doesn't seem great.
Okay. I did it. I beat Act 1. Deal 8 damage 2 times, gain 2 weak. Berserker combo, don't gain weak. They made Glass Knife conditional. Glass Knife was too strong. Playing 12 block, 12 counter, and a blur. During next turn, you're in ultimate stats. Pandas? You start with fewer... Holistic challenge, um, Phylostone. Five people are here to tell me what my own cards do. Thank you, five people. Oh, God. When I was an infant, my parents put a lot of work into teaching me to read. And I wonder if they realize, like, how unnecessary that was. Any logical thought, ability to read, ability to reason for myself, was just not necessary in the world that I was going to grow up to exist in. Boomers are very naive. Zero plus seven was seven things of the fourteen months. Appreciate it. I don't know if I needed to be able to read to make a Twitch account. Maybe. We have immediately gotten birds. Retain exhaust four tomb times without exacting your stats. Finisher. So basically, this gives me two strength. Also, give me a bunch of vigor. Okay. Cool. Understood. Why doesn't entering ultimate stance give me two energy? Hello? The people who worked on this character had clearly not played Watcher, the best slow this fire character in the world. Fernrose, thanks for the prime! These birds are a lot easier on low difficulty. Holy moly. It is remarkable how much easier this fight is. It's because I had logic and a desire to learn, which allowed me to identify an opportunity to be a Twitch streamer. No. When I was uh, 26, I woke up one morning and a hundred people were outside my window. They all told me like how to dress myself and clean my teeth and make breakfast. And then seven of them were like, if you open twitch.tv, you can make an account and become a streamer. And that's my origin story as a streamer. What's upgraded? Okay. I told you how to clean your teeth. I had a toothbrush sponsorship. It's true. It's true. I did have a toothbrush sponsorship once upon a time. I 
I'm starting to vaguely understand what's going on, which is nice. Only vaguely, though. We do fight the shopkeeper. One thing I feel like I've noticed is... It's unclear to me how I meant to get more energy in this mod, I guess. Like, unless I get um, energy bonuses from boss fights, it just kind of feels like I don't get more energy. What happens if you finish your ultimate stance? Oh, okay, cool. That is not a natural way for a shoulder to bend. Deal 14 damage, apply 2 vulnerable and 2 weak, and finish, eh? That good? I don't know. I don't think so. When you beat an elite encounter, gain one strength that's of each combat for the rest of the act. Perfecto Strike is not AoE. What are you talking about? Who told me it was? Why did you say that? That is not what it is. It does have the word all on it. That's true. Oh my god, I'm infinite. <laughs> Enter a stance you're not in. Kind of concerned about my cats. They've been doing some very smelly poops recently. <laughs> I get to hear the champ sound effects. I do not choose one of two cards which enter a stance to gain. And it will cost zero this turn. Sure. Oh, this one again? Murder Strike. What a fucking incredible name. When you use a skill, this deals two more damage this combat. Fucking Murder Strike. <laughs> incredible. <laughs> I'm down. You wonder if my Gurkha could let Downfall collect the same kind of stats about player game time that they do. 
I feel like there's a decent chance they do already. My favorite thing about Jorb's not mentioning the sexual tension is the all-time high-energy content, and that he always goes the extra mile of welcoming everybody by saying, hey, then your name. Hey, VK Blade, how are you? <clears throat> hey, little nope. Only if you type in chat, though. Lurker's very welcome. I'm not here to out lurkers. Also, I don't read the ones that have exclamation marks before them, so if you're lurking but you want to like call a bot command or whatever, I won't see it. I'll never know. You can call as many bot commands as you like, and I'll have no idea. I know where the defensive stance gives you counter, which, like, heals damage. <laughs> it's a strange thing for defensive stance to do. In my opinion. Ridiculous! Thank you very much for gifting a sub to Chibi Thulux. Appreciate it. I think they let the mod API access collated player data and win rates and stuff. I think if they like ask Anthony in an email for that information, Anthony would be like, oh yeah, sure, here you go. Or Casey, maybe, I don't know. Did I manage to complete the 1 HP challenge? You're asking for spoilers? You're asking for spoilers? I'll save you from yourself. I'm not gonna tell you. Uh, murder strike. Hell yeah. Murder strike deck? Probably Iron Fortress upgrade is better. Yeah, I am absolutely not going to say what happened in that on stream while a bunch of people are watching who may enjoy watching it without knowing, you know. You know? Your sister caught you watching my streams, and now she is in love with my content. Okay. I think that's, uh, I think that's kind of common. I think that's often how people discover things that they enjoy. This is going to die to counter. Or this could die to counter instead. Doesn't really matter, does it? Hmm, I think the other one might have been better. Hey buddy Gato! I'm glad to help. Is there a playlist command? Probably exclamation mark music. Would be my guess. Oh, you don't get to choose? Interesting. Wait, what is that? Next time you use a finisher this turn, all enemies lose 20 HP. Yo, I don't have a finisher. That's disappointing. <laughs> Oh, 
Why is that so slow? They're using the wrong sort of damage for that, I guess. I wonder what damage type that is. Thanks for the five months, Clisp. Incense Boiner. Moment of Truth. Draw a card, finisher. This seems good. This seems good to have. Next strike card, you play this turn, is played twice. Hold on. Triple strike? Murder strike? Hold on. Now we take Moment of Truth. Is it exhaust? Is it upgrade? No 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 you don't do that. You can definitely tell this is all original art because of the crowns on top. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. Well, I'll need a few card removes and then I'll be infinite, I guess. Doesn't actually seem very doable. I also need ultimate stats. Do I? Why? It draws two, not one. Okay, Mooney. Uh... an opener presumably need that before a finisher yeah i don't know openers are kind of sure do you think i could open for phoebe bridgers <laughs> i guess let's ask the real questions Technical Jig. Whenever you enter a stance, trigger skill bonus twice. It feels like it's gotta be good. Can anyone open for Phoebe Bridgers? Yeah. Yeah, when she uh, played in Seattle. <laughs> I mean. <laughs> hmm. Maybe I should be nice. The guy who opened for her in Seattle when I saw her was, uh, slightly better at music than me. But not, like, enough that I feel like I couldn't do it. I know what a guitar is. Yo. This character is kind of dumb. Reinforced body. Hello, old friend. This card's kind of good. It feels more interesting to take this than reinforced body, so I'll take this. I think reinforced body has got to be pretty good there, though. Intaco Axe, nice. 
Is that a guitar just a stick with strings attached that you walk around with? Yeah, it sounds like you've seen one in the wild. You seem to understand most of it. Does that work? No, because I'm already in it. Presumably. All right. What? The fuck card is this? That's a common? I don't think I've seen that yet. Here's a finisher to you. was in a shop. I guess I have seen it then. Moider streak. Mm, now I'm gonna go back and say that I haven't seen it. Back again. I don't want that. Book of Stabbing. Is... Three counter versus two Vigor. So I guess counter does more damage unless you're going to multi-hit. Okay. I'm learning. up who opened for Phoebe in Seattle and it was her backup guitar player on most of her work. You sure? Don't know if it was. The first time you use finisher each turn, gain an energy and draw a card. Yep. Agree? It's only once per turn, but yeah, obviously, happy to have that. Suddenly numbers.
Blessing of the Forge. Oh, another one? Okay. Does making metallicize cost two and also be footwork make it broken? Kinda. Maybe. This is just an infinite, like these two cards. You just upgrade this and upgrade this. You need another one of them, but like, that's too easy. I am oh, that's too easy. Those are just uncommons. It's just two of them. That feels like it's going to be the... Like, it's just going to be too strong. <laughs> it's just going to be way too strong. Because this is also infinite damage and block, right? You enter defensive stance when you leave it, it gives you 10 block. You enter um, offensive stance when you leave it, it gives you strength. It's way too strong. Watcher can infinite with starter cards if it gets Lotus Flower. Yes, but Watcher's too strong. <laughs> like, sure. You are correct that Watcher is also very strong. You remember when it was claimed there was no way this could be less balanced than Watcher? I still suspect it's more balanced than Watcher. Watcher has a very high skill ceiling and a fairly low floor. I don't know what those words mean. They just seem like random words to me. Not sure there's a ton of meaning in them anywhere. Blasphemer's Demise. When Watcher loses 63 more HP, apply minus 4 strength to her when she next enters Divinity or plays Ragnarok.
This is gonna give minus four strength. Wait, they're already dead. Huh? But then you gained four strength? Uh, okay. Sure, whatever. You're intangible. Intangible doesn't really work on enemies, because it's not telling me that my text deal zero. Which it presumably should be doing. Intangible for the blasphemy turn. Oh my god. Oh my god, you're right. <laughs> That's pretty awesome. Last stand. Once you get below 50% HP, remove all debuffs and gain 6 strength. What if you are already below 50% HP? I wonder. Berserker combo. Deal that much damage. Oh, so it's either reinforced body or skewer. That's cool. I'll just take another hold for him. It's both with ultimate and true. And is what ultimate does. Right. Oh, Skewer's probably pretty good on a character that can have 17 Vigor on turn 2. Hmm. Yeah. Looks like we've seen Omomori a lot. Oh, I don't know. I haven't really noticed that. The last place card this combat was a finisher. Deal 12 damage again. Nah, I'm good. Alright, the merchant. Okay, I'm fast enough here. I'll go to two shops this act, I think. You like the merchant there, a friend? Not anymore. Cool. 
too nigh. Finesse seems very good. Can I just take the Ness Kunai? I'm intangible. the cars that are just I'm the cooler ironclad. Yeah. Yeah, that character is kind of sweet. I don't know. I don't know. It's a lot, right? <laughs> Bottled technique. Trigger your current stances skill bonus five times. Seems like a really good potion. A nine block increased by vigor. To enter defensive. Oh, it upgrades differently from perfected strike, yeah. Oh wait, it does, it does more damage. Perfected strike is 12 plus two, instead of eight plus three, I think. Maybe. I don't know. Does that interact with your innate power? This one? Uh, I don't think so. It's impossible to say for sure. Shannon's hollow. Champ looks like it would perfectly fit in with a daft punk. Kinda true. I could see it. I could definitely see it. Let's bob it and weave. And endure. I'm gonna do that. And then go into defensive. And then do that, and also do that, and I don't know, I was just kind of randomly clicking buttons to be honest. Triple strike. Murder strike. Okay. Challenge again. It's kind of a good card, huh? Lose 90 souls. Obtain three random colorless cards. We gotta? I feel like we gotta. Oh, I can skip them if I want. Well, that's cheating. Another finesse. Hell yeah. Why? Why isn't it card rewards? I should have read the thing. You feel like this character does a lot and nothing at the same time. 
I think a thing that I'm consistently feeling about downfall characters is that... First, I guess. I feel like I'm consistently feeling that the mechanics that they have are overshadowing the numbers on the cards. Which I don't think is a good thing. But also, I think a lot of that is just that I'm playing on zero difficulty, you know? So the numbers on the cards don't really matter that much. next turn. It's gonna be kind of ludicrous. Is Ascension 20 not available for the mod? Uh, I haven't even unlocked all of the characters yet. I'm not going to unlock it by uh, text file. If I decide that I like the mod enough to play it all the way to Ascension 20, I will. And if I don't, I won't. an unlock all button somewhere. Yeah, but that's, that's okay. I should have gotten the zero cost draw too instead of <laughs> instead of getting that and just discarding it. That would have been a lot better. It's like almost the first time that I've played that without being in Berserker stance, the fan of knives. It's been doing better than I expected it to. Oh, it's all right. I wasn't looking. <laughs> I don't know if I could have done something to avoid that. Um, but I wasn't even looking at what was happening, so didn't even realize it was about to. The gem system for Guardian is really cool. The Guardian run was like pretty sweet, I think, vaguely. 
I vaguely remember that happening, and it was like, okay. Eventually you stop needing to look at what the enemy is doing. Yeah, that's not necessarily downfall. Some of that is um, Act 3. The YouTube title was very complimentary. I don't know what the YouTube title was. <laughs> But, but I am glad that my YouTube editor says that this is good. That's probably helpful for generating views. Worst boss is best character. Oh, about Guardian? Is Guardian the worst boss? I need that. It's probably okay with Kunai. Monkey all thanks for six months. Appreciate it. And of ready for my next run already. Wait, is technical jig innate? <laughs> should I should I know the answer to that question by now? Probably. We wanna go defensive so we can leave defensive for the 10 block. So the relics just isn't turned on. I think it kind of works with this mod, but when I had it turned on, it was lagging my computer, and then I got nauseous, and then I turned it off. And I have not turned it on again. I don't much want to. I'm going to go with the not doing things that make me nauseous approach to life for a little bit. Someone literally referred to it as your innate power. Yeah, but like, comments in chat are often like ridiculing me or like from people I do not know or care about or just like generally mean. And so I don't invest a lot of my energy in remembering what they were. So. Boom, boom. Sorry, who are you? <laughs> what are you apologizing for? I'm sure you're fine. The courier. Why is the courier different? Oh, because it's going down the spire instead of up. <laughs> I found adrenaline ish. It's an uncommon, apparently. Wait, if you're defensive, it doesn't exhaust. Exp 
Explore an event, search the treasury for a relic, hunt down the merchant. I didn't kill the merchant yet, huh? You got a card remove at worst. I should get a record player. Thoughts? Money. Got a backflip. Backflip with Kunai generally. Okay. So weird to like, I don't know. I'm playing this character in such a fair way. Not necessarily because it's the right way to play the character. I guess part of it is just not knowing the class yet. Oh, I have a career. I really don't want that. I can go to another shop. Well, uh, look at a bunch of cards. I kind of clicked random stuff. It's probably fine. It definitely could be okay. White Beast Statue only costs 190. Are you drunk? Does that happen to you when you're drunk? Whenever you draw a curse, your next attack deals three more damage. Charred Glove. <laughs> it's, a, it's a zero charge of memory. I like that. At the start of your turn, gain an impending doom with Retain. Okay. But Murder Strike is to the right of it, so it's never ever going to be. Wait. Oh, it's actually kind of interesting. I needed to do these first. Whoops. <laughs> um, okay. Maybe I don't need all of these retained reinforced bodies. I could keep one, perhaps. Oh, this time it's over there. I want to enter Berserker. I 
Enter ultimate combo. Oh yeah, and then this does everything. Okay. That's so many cards. I'm not really, like, reading what their stuff does. Do you think that's important? I don't know. I feel like it's probably fine. Doesn't matter on Ascension Zero. Do you think it matters on other difficulties? I don't know. Probably wanted to try to use these impending dooms there. Do this and both of these proc. What is my opinion about their decks sometimes built around Voodoo Doll? Their decks sometimes built around Voodoo Doll. The decks sometimes? I feel like your question isn't quite a question. Someone, thanks for the eight months. Appreciate it. Well, that was a fight, I guess. You feel something evil at your very core. Arise. You think now or the corrupt heart is worse? I, think I could go either way. Enter ultimate stance for the turn. Yeah, let's do that. Oh, I should have done this first. Whoops. Worse as a character to fight, or worse in how they live their lives? Yeah, and like their... The thing that they do. Add ethereal to all your cards. Oh no. Oh no, not murder strike. Oh, I guess that kinda... Beats up your ability to win with infinites, huh? have forky vigor somehow lol what I'm 
sorry, what? <laughs> okay. I'm pretty sure my ethereal cards are meant to exhaust at the end of turn. That is what it says they do. Protein does not override ethereal. I mean, you are writing what just happened. I was there too. <laughs> that is not how the rules engine works. Base game bug. I don't know what a base game means, but retain does not override ethereal in the base game. They gained ethereal after they were retained. Hmm. I don't know. This never happens in base game. <laughs> what are you talking about? You mean if the card has retain written on it? Because it like absolutely works in the base game that you retain cards with ethereal. retain an ethereal card but there's no way in the base game to add the text ethereal and the text retain to a card yeah i understand i don't think it's a base game bug if um it can never happen in the base game i don't know i don't know <laughs> i would <laughs> i would maybe just call that a bug with the like card What do I know? Yeah, I would question whether it's well known as well. That sounds like. <laughs> I, I have played thousands and thousands of thousands of hours of the game. I did not know that. Character dies, I'll care. Thought that was dead, but then it wasn't. There are a lot of reasons why that might have happened, I guess. Sword throw. Are you sure you never seen this interaction that happened in Ascension Zero of this mod? In my thousands of hours of the base scam? Well, it's a commonly known bug in the base scam. <laughs> so, so it makes sense that playing the base scam, I would have 
encountered it at any point in my I mean, I understand what's being said. <laughs> I understand what's being said. I would call this a bug and downfall, but... Having both retain and ethereal just doesn't really make sense anyway. Yeah. Yeah. Don't disagree with you. Someone created a pull request at Slay the Spire to fix this, and the senior dev closed it both. But why? Maybe. Possible. But an exhausting and bizarre conversation to have. Alright, anyway. You're dead. In stuff like Super Mario World, there are bugs in the engine for situations that don't happen in the game proper, but if someone built a level that allowed it, is that a bug with the level or the game? You could maybe say that it's a bug with the engine. I don't know. Another finesse? Sure. Finesse seems like a pretty good card here. I did try the Hermit, I did not like the Hermit very much. Let's go defensive and grab that and then draw three and then draw more. Feels like I didn't find very much. got what they were saying, you just don't really think it's accurate to say since it never happens in the base game. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I agree. It's very confusing to claim that it's a base game bug. But, you know, whatever. Maybe I just do that and remove my debuffs. Seems okay. Gain a slime. This 
So the issue is we've applied Ethereal to Murder Strike, which had Rattan. Now it has Ethereal and Rattan, two keywords. This card is in your hand. At the end of turn, it is exhausted. Exhausted cards are removed from your deck until the end of combat. Retain means it's not discarded at the end of your turn. So I guess the... <sighs> There's some stuff going on there with exactly how these things are chucked, huh? Because if you try to retain Wooly Plants, it's about the order of the end of turn effects. One of the weird interactions in the base game is that you can meditate a card with Ethereal, and it won't exhaust that turn. I don't know if that's a bug or not. The other cards in your hand with Ethereal still exhaust when you meditate. It's because meditate is coded as drawing after the end turn retain discard, not really a retain. Well, you're you're your use of the word really is interesting because as a player of the game meditate retains a card <laughs> so Let's go Wrath, Defense, Wrath, Defend here, and that hits pretty hard. Why did the card have an outline? I don't know. You like to imagine everyone arguing with George is either a Magic Judge or a Slay the Spire modder? Yeah, probably. How could it not be exhausted? It says if this card is in your hand at the end of turn, it's exhausted. Retain just makes sure it remains in your hand. Therefore, it exhausts if you don't play it. What are you missing? Oh, this is like clearly a bug. This is this is clearly a bug that it's working like this. I think I'm okay with saying that it's like a bug in how the base game's code resolves ethereal and retain when cards have both. I think I'd be okay with saying that. It's just like saying that it's a common base game bug is like so disrespectful to Slay the Spire. I don't know, but I don't know. I don't know. Maybe that's uh... Maybe I'm wrong or something. I want to double play Dancing Master someday.
the number of statuses in the boss fights, like, it's kind of gross. It's kind of too many. I was already in Berserker. Whoops. stuff going on here. Oh, this is my last finisher. Whoops. Sam, how are you? The dog Alex Bits. I played some more of my Hokenshi the day after I played it sponsored. I don't know if I'll play more of it than that. Maybe. Possible. Interesting. It feels like, um... It feels like when you have cards like Murder Strike in the game, it feels like the mod is kind of balanced around Ethereal Retain not losing the card. Because, like, you wouldn't make a rare card that did this if in the boss fight it just immediately exhausted. Like, what would be the point? It is a card for solving boss fights. Right? <laughs> Seems like it. But if it just exhausts immediately because of the statuses that the whale is giving you, then it kind of doesn't work. Modder's intended confusion? I don't know about that. I need a finisher.
No, this isn't intended, Sam. But I'm pretty sure that as the player, I'm not meant to uh, avoid it either. It's a bad turn. Issue is that retain the keyword and retain the effect should always act the same regardless of if the retain was added by a keyword or effect. It doesn't matter which way it works, just that it works the same way. Sounds possible, I don't know. Murder strike cost two again. That also seems like a bug. When you play another card, muddle your hand and discard this. Muddling a card changes the cost this turn. Oh, okay. So muddle isn't what I thought it was. Understood. Have some strikes. I do not like adding retain to cards. That's just maybe not a thing that should be done. Yeah. Because you really don't want cards to be malleable. Like, you don't want a card. One of these hold frames has retain and one of them doesn't. Can you tell? <laughs> I mean, <laughs> we can work it out because it's the one on the left, but looking at the game right now, can you tell? You need to be able to tell that shit. Also, this one has ethereal. <laughs> This one has retain and this one has ethereal. Both of those are things that you probably want to know to be able to play the game, right? Love that my 119 damage counter goes before my 3 damage bronze scales. <laughs> Alright, I defeated Niao two hours later. How'd the first one gain retain? There's a card that generates skills and gives them retain. Ascension unlocked error. Sorry, what? Berserker style. Okay. Okay. 
Target enemy gains one strength. Gain ten vigor. What a beautiful automaton. Um, error is a commonly known base game bug. <laughs> Wait, where the fuck did downfall go? What? Oh, it's here. Okay. I never looked at, um... I did look at Waifu Hexaghost. Waifu Chan? Chan P? Her sword looks impossible for her to wield, but she's actually the only one strong enough to lift it. Laundry day champ, wonderful. 